Hey guys, today we're going to be trying some of the best beef jerky in town. It's called Jeff's Famous Beef Jerky. Super premium, by the way. They were very nice about it. Go check them out. They gave all this beef jerky to us for free. I'm going to link it down below. And hopefully we're going to love all of them because I'm a beef jerky person. You like beef jerky? I could eat like a bucket of it daily, <laughs> honestly. I mean, beef jerky is so good. And this one looks so like, it looks so juicy. You know, yeah. like juicy beef jerky is what you're looking for. Look at all these packages. I think they sent us a total of seven. Yeah. Look how nice they are. They're nicely packaged and enough in there for us to try it, for sure. So we're gonna face them all to the back where it's completely white and then just shuffle them and you're gonna just pick one. Right. Also, I wrote down all the flavors in my journal. We're going to rate them from zero to 10, zero being the worst and 10 being the best. And I'm not expecting any of these to be anywhere near yeah. zero, but we're gonna rate them because that's what I do. I'm just gonna pick this bottom one. And it is Korean barbecue, like little like sesame, sesame seeds. seeds. This one's in the sweet category. Most of these are sweet, but they also have spicy. Smell test. Oh. Uh, that smells like teriyaki. Chicken. Yeah. Mmm. Mmm, that smells good. Smell test, 10 out of 10. Yeah. That, More than fun. 10. This is like my favorite food kind of smell. All right, Max, go ahead and reach in there. All right, Whoa. let me get one, and we'll try it together. Got a nice piece, too. Oh. Whoa. Okay, I think you this should is... <laughs> cut that up a little bit. This is so soft and juicy. Yes. All right, ding. Bing. Mm. This one's, like, super sweet. But very good. I'd probably rate it good, like, 10 out of 10, honestly. It's a little messy. Because the sesame seeds could like fall off, but like this one's also a 10 out of 10 for me. So, here's a ladybug. So far, this one's the winner. We didn't leave any room for any other ones to be winners, but we'll see. <laughs> we'll, we'll compare the top like three maybe. I don't know. But I really wish I didn't get that taste out of my mouth. It was so delicious. For the Korean barbecue, we both picked 10. So now it's your turn to pick the one. Alright, I'm excited for this. Maple brown sugar bacon jerky. jerky. I've never eaten bacon jerky before. So yeah. this would be a nice surprise, I guess. Yeah. Oh my gosh. I was excited for this because I actually love maple brown sugar bacon. When I go to Duck Donuts, that's the only donut I get because it, it has like bacon bits on top. It's so delicious. Okay. I haven't tried any of this, so this is going to be a surprise. This is going to be delicious, I think. Let's do the smell test. That's really bacony. That sounds oh, like yes. real bacon. It, sound, it smells like morning eggs and bacon. It has a little bit of like the jerky smell, but it doesn't smell artificial to me, which is interesting. Oh, pizza. Ooh, that's a nice looking piece. I mean, yeah, this is definitely real bacon. You know what? I'm just gonna like take a bite of this. I got you, a, <laughs> you got a tiny I, piece. I got a smaller piece, but that's fine. All right, let's try it. Boop. Boink. Mmm, I love it. I actually love it. For me, I would either go for 8.5 or 9 because I like the bacon. I like how it's sweet, but it's a little too sweet. So I'll just say 9. Max, think about a donut. But like me loving maple syrup bacon, this is also a 10 for me. It is growing on me a little bit. Maybe. I'll just say 9.5. I mean, it's not beef jerky. Yeah. This is ba this is technically pork jerky. Yes. Right. So I don't know if it could be the top one, but oh, if you like the maple syrup bacon or whatever, literally this is the thing to get. Like literally, and also I make my own donuts at home and sprinkle this on top because I never give enough bacon. So it's nineteen point five. That's the second highest so far. This isn't even because he just sent it to us. Yeah. You know, I'm not just faking. Yeah. To make it just to for him to be happy that he sent it to us so that we can market their stuff. Yes. Like no, this is like for real, in my opinion. I'm not gonna fake it, okay? Alright Max, I'll, I'll fix it for you. Ooh. Jalapeno carne asada. I definitely said that wrong, but Jalapeno carne asada. This is mildly spicy. I told him that I'm okay with mild spices. So carne asada is something that you get in Mexican restaurants. 
But I never get it, so I really don't know like, mm. what to compare it to. That's a very strange aroma. It smells like a sweet taco. Like, it has all the taco ingredients, but it has like this, almost like the Korean style sauce on it. That's what it smells like to me. It smells like, like a taco or a burrito. Yeah, it smells like me a Mexican food. All right, let's try it. Right. You get the first one. I need a flosser. We don't love floss after this. <gasps> Max, we forgot to wash our mouths out. Here. I took care of my friend's baby this weekend. I think we could talk from that. All right, let me pick mine. Ooh, these are so soft. This look, this already feels so tender. All right, go ahead. Point. Carne asada. Very flavorful. Wow. Explosion of flavor. I feel like I'm tasting a whole burrito. Like the corn, everything, the lettuce, beans, that is so weird. It's like a Willy Wonka one. Like that chewing gum. And it's spicy too. That's the most flavorful one. Yes. Uh, usually with beef jerky and stuff, you have to like chew it at least like three times to get flavor out. But this one, like right as I put it in my mouth, immediate explosion. I think this is perfect for when you want Mexican food. You don't have any. Do you taste the jalapeno? Because I definitely taste the carne asada part. But like the jalapeno, I don't really have that flavor in my mouth. I don't have that. Just because of that, I'm going to rate it a 9. I might say an 8. I like it, but it's not really the classic beef jerky, if you know mm -hmm. what I mean. This is a very specified one. If you really like this one, you'll love it. Yeah. But if you're like, you like other ones, kind of like how we like the Korean barbecue one better, yeah. that's just what we're going to pick. All right, so 17 for the jalapeno carne asada. So far, it's in third place. All right, your turn. Shuffle up a little bit. Jamaican jerk. Oh, we're having all the... We're doing a continental beef jerky review. Oh, that smells like very strong jerky. <clears throat> this is like the man of the jerks. This is like, this is a lumberjack. Dink. Wink. This one's a medium hot. I don't know about you, but I like it. That's good. Maybe I've, I've just never had Jamaican food before, but like, that is really weird to me. Like very new. It's a new taste. I also like it, but it's kind of too manly for me. I'd rate this an eight. I'd rate it a nine. Flavorful. It's chewy. I like that. And it's spicy. All the things you need. It is spicy. I like the spice level actually. So that's also a 17. Orange appeal. I've been waiting for this one because I have no idea like what to expect here. Is it just orange peel flavor or oranges? Because it says peel and orange. It's right? probably both. I have no idea. It's a so mystery. Flavor. I'm excited for this one. This one's like a new territory for me. I've yes. never tried orange beef jerky uh, ever. It smells like beef jerky. It's, it's, it's a little. There's like a, there's one orange peel in here. Oh my it's goodness. Like that. This is so soft. Do you see that? It's floppy. You know, floppy beef jerky is going to be good. All right. Bink. <laughs> High five. Mmm. <laughs> you can definitely taste the orange way better than smell it. This is really good. It's very odd. I think it's because you've never tried orange peel foods. This is delicious. If you like... That orange peel flavor, it's really good, and it's also not overwhelmingly orange. W what do you think? Is it overwhelming for you? I, not really. It's just very odd to me. Like, it's beef jerky, but it's not beef jerky. I'll say probably a 6.5, honestly. I definitely, you? this is a 9 for me. Because it's, I think I just like the sweet flavor. 15.5. 15. 15. So, so, far the, so far, the yeah, so far the orange appeal one is the lowest score. All right, <laughs> that was very fast. Cranberry jalapeno. Okay, I'm excited this for one it. I'm like I wanted to try because I remember the first time I heard cranberry, I was very confused. It just sounds so different. And also, I can't imagine cranberry with jalapeno. It doesn't make sense. This smells like Thanksgiving. Whoa. What is that smell? It's kind of familiar. This one smells like the carne asada one. 
Maybe that's it. They're both jalapeno. Yeah, is that yeah. jalapeno we're smelling? A little bit. Oh my gosh, this one's... <laughs> they're like so like tender. High five. Right. Hang on. It's gonna rip off. <laughs> Alright. Alright. I don't taste the cranberry. Oh, <laughs> Am I missing something? Sweet and mildly spicy. Okay, well, I could tell that, but I mean, I taste a little bit of both. It's like so mild. I can taste the jalapeno a little better, but the cranberry is very mild. Like, it's just sweet. You don't even taste like the sour, like cranberry yes. taste. I know it says mildly spicy, but it's not spicy. It's not spicy at all. Yeah. All right, you rate it first. I'm the harsh rater here. I don't know. I, I'm sad to do it, but like probably like a seven. This is like my least favorite by far. I would rate like a six. I'm very happy we have these period waters because there's a lot of beef. That's a 13. All right. Cranberry jalapeno is the loser for right now. Yes. All right, for the grand surprise, it is the... Sweet smoking barbecue. Nice. Sweet and smoking barbecue. This is the classic. I that's guess. that's the kind of barbecue we eat. Yes. We love smoked anything. Yeah, our dad actually smokes meat. He smokes beef, pork, everything. Chicken. All right, smell test. Ah, classic. That is smoked. Like that. so floppy. I love it. High five. Mmm. That's delicious. Alright, for flavor, five out or ten out of ten. I was but, like, what? But I would want it to be a little more chewy. That's my opinion. So I would say nine point five. Maybe we just got a really soft piece. So these are all like super soft. Yeah. These are by far the softest ones. Like look at this. Hey. Smokiness could be a bit overwhelming sometimes, but like the sweetness really helps with the smokiness. They both come together. A like very an good combination. Very good combination, like perfect. I could tell how this is award winning. And that sounds really good. I vote this a 10. I really love the flavor, but I want beef jerky to be very chewy. It's like Wagyu beef. It is like Wagyu beef, 19.5. All right, let's take out the three top winners. And then see which one's the ultimate winner. Sweet smoke barbecue, Korean barbecue, and bacon maple brown sugar. This is what we're dealing with. The ultimate loser is the cranberry jalapeno. It got a 13. I don't know if there's anything that could have fixed it, honestly. It's just cranberry jalapeno. We didn't really like the flavor that much. Yeah. But these three, I don't even know which one's the best. But you could kind of tell that we like barbecue. I like this one. This one, oh, probably this my favorite. This so good. I think definitely these two are the top ones. This one's third place. It's more like, this one's like a regular barbecue. It's like something I've tried before. Yeah. It's... This one is like, yeah. Let's both get one of these and one of these and then compare them side by side. So here I have the Korean barbecue and then the sweet and smoked. Let's smell them. <sighs> this one's very smoked. The smoked is so yeah, clear. This here. one. It's more like, it, it's it not really like, noticeable. It smells so good. It smells like fried food. Or like, it smells like when you drive by a Chinese restaurant. <laughs> <laughs> Basically, I guess. <laughs> it smells Th so good. This one's just the smoked beef. Mm. That's enjoyable. Okay. I have my winner. I don't have clear results yet. I have I, clear results. Side by side, you can definitely taste the, um... The soy sauce. I don't know, man. They're both tens for a reason. Okay, I think Korean barbecue is a winner for me. Same right? for me, same for me. So, if you're gonna get just famous beef jerky, and you like a sweeter type of jerky. We still didn't try this one, though. Okay, yeah, let's try the maple syrup. Yeah, I'm not eating this. I don't know, Max, this is still like, like I'd prefer this right now. It feels illegal to compare it to beef. Yeah, true. But it's so good. Which one's better, this one or this one? 
For this for a second? Do your opinion. I'm going to let you do Okay. It. This is my opinion only. Number one. Number two. Number three. What's yours? I agree. You agree? Yeah. One, two, three. All right. So we have a clear winner. Korean barbecue is our winner. It was the first one we tried and also the last that we loved. And again, I want to thank Jeff's Famous Beef Turkey. It really was amazing. Thank you for sending these to us to try. And a lot of this is personal choices because I know if I gave these to my friend, like her opinion would be completely different. I recommend you to go try out all of these flavors, especially these top three. I'm going to link it in the description. All right, guys, um, my next video is going to be really cool. I already recorded it. Um, I really think you're going to like it. So go ahead and click the subscribe button. If you like this video, like the video. We really enjoy trying all these flavors. Like, I can do this all day. Check out my Etsy shop. It's also linked down below. Follow me on Twitch. I stream sometimes, mostly Minecraft. If you have any suggestions, please comment them in the comments. And I appreciate all of you guys who are commenting in my comment section. It means so much to me. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Bye. All right, whose turn is it? Your, Your turn. turn. I just won. I fixed that. And also... <laughs> the, the pen fell. All right, so for the Korean barbecue, we both... All right, let me just get a Crayola. Oh, <laughs> why do you just eat it? <laughs> oh my gosh, that's a giant piece. <laughs> That'll work. Did you hear that? Yeah, I did. I wonder if the mic picked that up. <gasps> My belly is about to explode. <laughs> Again, I want to thank Jeff's famous beef jerky. I could see how it's award winning. I would go to like, I'd go to some beef jerky show and award, award awards. I've then. never heard of a beef jerky show. That's just that unheard of. Something. That has to be a thing. You know, there's Minecraft championship. So.